How are you guys doing today? It's been a bit. It's been two days? Two days since I last streamed. Uh, sorry about that. I had work and um, it just takes it out of me. And then I got to do like adult things. Not like fun adult things, but like boring adult things. Like pay bills. And so when I'm doing boring adult things, it just sort of takes the shit out of me. So, uh, anyway, we're going to play Wander Song because I need, I need a game like this right now. Someone has, a, a few people have expressed, well, let me turn off the music. A few people have expressed concern about whether or not, oh, hey, thank you for 27 months of support gear. I'm going to just drop this here. I got two days off work, so time to catch up on some VODs. Well, good luck. Um, I don't know how far behind you are, but you should be okay to do that. Um, let's see. Let me get it all set up good. I just need, like, a good game. Top Houndor, thank you for six months of support. That's half a year. It is indeed. Thank you so much. Um, but, uh, I guess we're in Spooky Town now. Uh, someone has expressed concern, or a few people have expressed concern about Yakuza. I think it will come back. I, I just, it was between this or your Yakuza today, and I kind of don't want this to go down the way Yakuza did. So that's why I'm not streaming Yakuza today. Does that make sense? No, doing it anyway. Why has everyone got like a, a Lussus? Hi. We want to stay here. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, well, you can't. All the rooms are taken except for one, and that one is haunted. What? Really? Normally, I'd be completely kidding, but right now, I'm not. Hey, Bard. Can't you sing to Ghost or whatever? Yeah. Yeah, I can. Really? Normally, we'd be completely kidding, except for when we never are because we are an actual walking do joke. Well, if you're willing to brave it, it's the very last door upstairs. Yakuza is a good game, don't get me wrong. I just, I haven't been in the mood, and I feel like, um, as soon as it's like, and now for real estate, it's like, oh. And it's like, I like statistics more than the next person, but like, eh. No, I've been told that has, that is not the entirety of the game. So, okay, cool. Um, it's a mean ghost. Well, there you go. Uh, but I feel like I do that to a lot of games, and I really don't want to do that to that game. Also, I do want to get started with a couple of games. One of my coworkers convinced me into doing, um, uh, Dang It Ron Paul. And so I'll probably, uh, look into that at some point. I'm very, very dyslexic. So, that might suck. Oh, it's locked. <laughs> I guess she forgot to give me the key. Just go back for it. I like how he wouldn't run towards that door, but you know. Uh, she recommended it because, um, oh, wait a minute. Uh, is it just me or is there like way more hallway no matter what? Uh. Shara, thank you for the, uh, the raid. It was very kind of you. But, uh, yeah, I played a bit of, uh, Zero Time Escape, which apparently is on Steam as well. Uh, I'd be down for doing that again. And maybe actually, like, stream it. I thought it was a DS game only. I thought I was stuck in a Flintstones loop. Oh. Oh. Oh, you, you're a spoopy ghost. Ace Attorney was good. I liked it. Oh, shit. Time for songs. Oh, it's down.
Oh, I have to. Oh, I get it. This is such a good game. Minstrel, your voice. Can you lend it to me? Deliver this to Rules King. End this war. Well, that's dealt with now, I guess. Hey, stranger. Uh, Miriam? Miriam! I'm awake, I'm awake. Sheesh. The spirit. Is it really gone? Yep. Maybe we're wrong about you. We thought you were from over the border. Huh? You must really be a stranger to these parts, hey? We sure are. Well, let me make things simple for you. Around here, there are two big kingdoms. Rule, that's us, in the east. And... The Shandesh in the West. We've been at war for generations. Why? A great many reasons, Traveler. Their assaults on us are never ending. Even this very forest was once a l once lush with trees and flowers, but the Shandesh burned it down. They have no regard for nature. We're in the no man's land, but uh, on the border here. So I always got to keep watch for spies. If that Ghost chase you off. She was Chandesh as well. Stra. She gave me a message. For the king of rule. A message for our king from Chandesh? That can't be any good. What's the message? I don't know. But she said it would end the war. I feel it waiting in me. I think we should deliver it. It's definitely not a weapon. It could be a bomb. That would end a war. Kill the king? That's how you play chess. Checkmate. Why does this crap always happen to us? What? I said, great. Let's go deliver the ghost message to the king. Yeah. I appreciate the favor you did for me and my inn, stranger. So I won't stop you. But I will say, be careful with a message like that. It's probably hard to understand because you ain't from here. But anything from Chandesh, we've learned not to trust. What? But she seemed so nice. I mean, she was all haunty and scary, and she attacked me with rainbow ghost balls. But after that, she was nice. I'm sure it's fine. I can change the... Oh man, that's an awful dance song. Listen to that. You like that sound? This is why, this is, this is, that's how you get rid of viewers. Well, up, up and away. Uh, what? Let's fly. No. No? I'm tired. I slept on the floor. Barely. You try carrying on with you for a couple of days. See how you feel about doing it for another day after that. 
I'm I I have to deal with myself all of the fucking time. You're walking. I literally don't know what you're referring to, Bob Dole, but The blood color thing, yeah. I mean, like, how that has anything to do with anything that's happened, yeah. That's the bit I'm, I'm confused about. Whoa! That's a pretty big wall. Just... Is that... Is that what... Is that what the blood spectrum thing from Homestuck is like? I should probably do that episode and then also uh, go record all of the other episodes uh, over again. Because we're almost at the end of that, and... I don't know. I'm a little bit concerned that, like, the, the way that I find that people actually know that I've uploaded that is because of Tumblr and because Tumblr is banning itself. Uh, I'm a little bit concerned on whether or not everyone's, anyone's actually there to watch any of the, the videos I post there. So we'll see how that goes. And that may mean that just people stop showing up for Homestuck, which sucks. Because, like, there's an audience for it and they want to watch it, but they won't be told about it, which is ass. Because YouTube won't tell them about it. Something tells me that it's not being sent out to all my subs. If I have less than a 10% watch rate on a video, I'm going to assume that maybe like half of you guys have time. You know what I mean? Are you uploading Homestuck porn? You know it. Uh, is that just because we keep... Uh, yeah. Seems kind of excessive. But they must be serious about it. I probably shouldn't just go around it. We might get in trouble. I wonder if there's some way we can someone we can talk to. What should we do? Walls down. Miriam! That's against the law, I'm pretty sure. I'm I told you. We're gonna have to break a few rules, right? Yeah, double check your uh your subs on I upload stuff to, yeah, well, I post stuff on Tumblr, so that way if you miss it when it goes on Twitter and Facebook and YouTube itself, then Tumblr might catch you. It's just sort of casting a wide net, so that way somehow you might watch or at least hear about the video so you'd go watch it. You know, it's it's uh, somewhere around 30 videos a month uh, that I upload between the three channels. So there's pretty much new rev content every single day which may be part of the problem as well but uh zarketh thank you for 15 months of support double check the subs you say that not that's not what i meant but thank you oh come on she's like chaotic neutral and the bard is like i want to say like chaotic good or neutral good neutral good because he just cared about the wall getting blown up but he has his own moral compass so maybe that makes him like lawful good because lawful isn't necessarily where he cares about the law. He just entirely holds to... It might be neutral. It might be neutral good. But Miriam's definitely like chaotic neutral. Just, I do what I want. This is about me. Neutral good leaning towards chaotic. That sounds right. Hey, have you noticed how quiet it is? There's almost no birds or animals here. I like that dance. It's true. There is no noise. Whoa. What happened here? Looks like a monster attack. Hmm. Maybe it's nice. Like the ones on Delphi. Yeah, probably not. Let's be careful around here. Are those scratches on the wood? Are we gonna get murdered? Miriam, are we gonna get murdered? Miriam, 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 Miriam. Are we gonna get murdered? I think we're gonna get murdered. Looks like the wall was there to protect the forest. 
since the other side got so wrecked, but this side got pretty wrecked too. I said that the other kingdom burned it down, right? This is definitely does not look like burning. There's something weird going on out here. What do you want to bet that there's like some asshole just rampaging about that's keeping this war going on? Like some sort of dragon or some shit. Sorry, you needed to take a drink. Hey. Oh, hey. That looks like a thing. I didn't like that. I was so scared. But I guess it wasn't so bad. Yeah, it's just one little guy. I wonder where he came from. The big guy. Right there. Yeah, that's good. Oh. We should run. We should sing. What? It works, right? We just have to get through the forest to the king. So, we have to try. You know what? Sure. Knock yourself out. Not doing it quite right. This is what it's like to play a bard in D&D &D sometimes though. It's like, this problem can only be solved with violence or music. And then you act like a theater kid. I don't know what my damage against, like, theater kids is. I'm sorry if you are one. Like, it just... I saw too many plays growing up. And not good ones. Natalie is a former theater kid. I am very sorry. Am I doing this right? Because I feel like I'm not making any progress at this point. The music sounds a little clusterfucky. Wow, what a bunch of chumps. Let's keep going before they come back. I think like I needed to do it in a certain way. I was, um, fuck. I cleaned out, I had, th I have a tackle box, right? Like that you would use for fishing crap that I got when I was, uh, well, it was 2002 apparently when I got it, um, 2002, 2003. So 2003, hold on. 1988 minus 2003. Negative 15. Okay, I was negative 15 years old, apparently, uh, when I was playing a whole bunch of Mage Knight, and I cleared it out so that way I could have room for my, my Warhammer crap. I was that kid. 
video games and nerdy board games and stuff that you've never heard of and not in a hipster way where it's cool and a not oh halt stay back from the wall identify yourselves what's a witch doing here in the forest what we're delivering a message for the king what's wrong with us being here dude you're a witch yeah I so what those are these are dangerous times we can't just let you in and then it cut out hold on a moat what's going on man there's a witch at the gate whoa what here in the forest let me see they say I have a message for the king huh really they seem to be okay to me <laughs> Phil they're obviously spies I don't know man they look like refugees to me we can't just can't we we can't just leave them with the monsters can we I think we can no way I'm in man ain't no time to be uncouth All right, I'm letting you in, but come through quickly. What do you want to bet the uh the weird animals are are in Uh, okay, can you not? Stay back. Jeesh. Ping, man. Yeah. Tell your qui Quinn to cool it. What's everyone's deal here? Are you or are you not from Chandesh? No. Y you're sure. What about the witch? What? No. Seriously. What's your problem? Because witches come from Chandesh, man. Wait. Aren't they both saying that they're from Chandesh? Or uh, the other one? Pink, she has no idea what's going on here. You gotta cool it. Seriously not cool, dude. Okay, okay, sure. Is your animal gonna attack us again? We cool. Okay, okay, great. Is that a panda or a goddamn squirrel? Yes. Yes, it is. Okay, okay, great. You two are totally welcome here, okay? There's got a lot going on with the monsters and all, so it's all a bit crazy right now. You really don't seem like you're dangerous to us. We're going to take it easy now, okay? Y'all like, like this? Humph. You're both lucky that Phil's... In, you're both lucky that Phil's in charge here. That sentence made more sense after I finished it. If you're innocent, apologize. I apologize for my aggression. If you're innocent, I apologize. Otherwise, I'm going to continue to be an asshole. It is like a car alarm going off in the parking lot. Like, it's like 2 a.m. And then someone gets home from a night of drinking and they're kind of buzzed and they can't figure out how to turn off their thing. And so it's just like... Yeah. But I have my mother to worry about me as well. We can't be too careful these days. So I'll be keeping an eye on you. Are you going to finish that Hive Swappy theme? I'm going to finish Hive Swap. For sure. Does your mom want to break it down low? Apparently not, no. I'm sorry my son gave you trouble. Ignore him. He's a fool. You and your friends seem perfectly nice to me. There's so much to this game that I'm not doing just because I'm not hitting the thing when I could. Hey there, Wayfarer. I want him being a yellow dog. Sorry I didn't introduce myself. I'm Phil. I'm kind of the boss around here. Sorry about peeing. This monster, is, this monster situation's got him all wound up. Leaving it here is dangerous. We've been trapped here for days now. You know how it is. Gotta ask, though. How did you get through the woods here? I'm just saying to the monsters. Whoa, no kidding? You two will fit right in then. We play music here every night. Keeps the spirits up. You should join us tonight, Wayfarer. We're going to put all this ugly behind us. 
We'll be setting up the fire soon. Just let me know when you're ready. Yeah. Is that a bear dog? I think it's like a lab and a bear. Hey. Ain't so many of us left here now. You got you think the king even knows about us stuck here? I bet he doesn't. Or he doesn't care. So like where who what the fuck? This place sucks. Miss Zentia. Xantia. Ask if Xantia is right for you. Side effects include... Now I'm stuck here. With nobody but Grandpa and our Quinn. Sigh. What the fuck is this? You need to address this thing. This, this creature right here. What is it? Dog bears are actual creatures from prehistory. Okay. Want to get the fire going? You've all been trapped here? Yeah, pretty much. We're here uh, to turn the trees into lumber. It's nice work living amongst the forest, but there are monsters that showed up before it got dangerous. So we had a lot more folks working the mill and all. Oh gosh, did they all... Oh no, they didn't die. At least I don't think so. I left in a big group for Zentia with the hero. She was here? Oh yeah! She saved our lives! But... We had elderly kids and Quinn and... Folks that couldn't do the intense journey with her. So a few of us stayed back to keep them safe. We're hoping the king sends back help soon. She's kind of a bitch, I'm not gonna lie. It's a lot on our minds, Wayfair. That's why we need campfire songs. Okay, so we want to get the fire going? Yeah. Yes, I'm so ready too. Time for fucking party. Beautiful night, eh? All in honor of our new wayfaring friends, I'm going to tell an old tale. About a wayfarer and a witch. They say it happened here in this very forest. And they say if you listen real close, you can hear their spirit singing along too. Why not start us off with a G Wayfarer? Uh, Does this sound like it's off tempo horribly? I might be doing it wrong too. I think you're supposed to swing and follow it. Uh, that's not normally how it goes. I think he's implying that we're going to fall in love with the witch. And she's kind of a bitch. 
So that's probably not going to happen. Cool song. Thanks very much, Warfare. We've been singing it for generations. It's convenient, but it's kind of sad, too. Why did the witch curse the Wayfarer if they were in love? Hmm. You know? I never really thought about it. Yeah, he's chipping us. And it's weird because he's just met us. And there's, like, not any chemistry at all. It's weird. Guess I always figured the witch was somehow a kind of trickster. He snatched up the Wayfarer's soul. No, but why? Maybe it's just a stupid made-up song. Who cares why? Well, not totally made up. Like I said, it happened in these woods, and the Wayfarer was a girl from Rule. And her soul got snatched? Well, that's how the story goes. Sounds pretty made up to me. Or what? Do you think witches just go around snatching souls? Holy crap. I mean, like, they, they, they don't have any... Ki they hate each other. I mean, unless if we're playing... What is it? Helga? Sundre? Like, if we're pulling one of those things, that's, like, one of the most violent things you can say is Helga from Hey Arnold is Sundre. Like, that's just evil to say that to human beings. Because you have to explain that, and it's just not good. Holy crap, do you actually... No, no, well... Rustar, thank you for one month... Or... 23 months a little bit of difference there one more month until it's uh two years but thank you for 23 months of support that's very kind of you we aren't used to seeing witches it's kind of hard to know sometimes they're cruel folk witches what are you talking about where do you think the forest monsters came from they're soldiers from chandesh magically created and sent here to attack us and destroy our precious forests didn't know that. There's reason we've been trapped here. Is it? Oh fuck! Oh fuck! I need to talk about that. Oh god. Okay. So give me a minute. So a guy calls in the other day, right before close, right? And he's like, "Hey man, um, I bought, I bought, I think it was NBA 2K19. I bought NBA 2K19, uh, digitally." From the PSN store. I'm like, okay. And he's like, well, I can't download it. Uh, do, do I need to have an internet connection to download it? And I'm like, uh, yeah, yes, sir. Well, I've got a, a hotspot on my phone. Can I use that? And I'm like, well, apparently not. Um... He's like, well, if I if I have proof that I bought it, can I swing by the store and then you guys could just give me a physical copy of the CD? I'm like, um, no, 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 sir. Um, I can't do that for you. Um, I can, however, give you the phone number for Sony. Um, from the Sony phone line, if you want to talk to them. I'm sure GameStop has to deal with the same bullshit as us. We got some prank callers yesterday and they weren't even good. They were like... They had a different thing every time, but they didn't block their phone number. And it's like, dude, if you're going to prank call me, block your number. And I told them as much and they're like, but we did. And they were trying to get me to do... It was some sort of Ligma situation, you know? I'm sorry. I'll continue with the game and just sing it here. But it was some sort of like Ligma thing where it was like... Can you... I forget what it was. Uh, Mowgli? I don't know that one. They asked if I had Lego Mowgli for the Switch. And I said, yeah. And they're like, no, you don't. I'm like, yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. It's, uh... Yeah. Yeah, I got it. I'm, I'm holding it right now. He's like, you are? And I'm like, yeah. Yeah, I am. Well... well What's the name of it? I'm like, it's that Lego game you wanted. What, what, what's the full name of it? Le, 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 it's Lego. Le, le, but what, And they got upset because I wouldn't say whatever it was. And I'm sure it was like a Ligma thing that if I had gone like... And I don't remember what he said, to be honest. I asked him to spell it and I think he spelled out like bum stuff or something like that because... He's just professional quality prankster. Halfway in, he decided he was Australian. And he, he decided to prove that by just saying, like, 
a whole bunch of Australian things loudly. And he's like, in a really shitty Australian accent. It's a Ligma thing, Dad. You wouldn't get it. Do you know what that is, Mowgli? Like, what that, that meme is that they were trying to get me to say? I'm sure it was something like that. Anyway, uh, there's a reason why we've been trapped here. Or they're the reason. But why? That's the scariest thing about the Chandesh. We don't know why. But from their actions, it's clear that they hate us. They have no regard for nature or our way of life. Is this one of those, like, they've been at war forever and... I don't know if it's a gremlin thing. I, no, I'm old as fuck. No, no one in the chat knows what this meme is. We're getting old, guys. We don't know what the memes are anymore. Can't ask for battle toads anymore. Tell us, which you said you had a message for the king. Who is it from? What is the message? What's a meme? I know. What is a meme? What are memes? What meme? The Mowgli meme. It's a secret. I don't know what the Mowgli thing is. I have vintage memes. Where we go. Ligma, it's the new updog. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm just talking about the Mowgli thing. I don't know what that is. Or even if I'm pronouncing it right. But I have a feeling it's... Mowgli? Is it Mowgli? Someone explain the meme. I'm old now, I guess. Or maybe it's just a shit meme. What if it's just a really bad meme? You know what a really bad meme is? The new Sonic poster? The digital poster? First off, not a bad idea. Uh... It's... Okay, I like the idea of a digital poster for a movie. That makes sense. I like the idea of Jim Carrey being Dr. Robotnik. Especially after seeing Sonic Boom, that seems like a great idea. But... But, oof, oof, um, we haven't, okay, I'm just gonna say it, at the time of this recording, we have not seen the actual creature, but it doesn't seem promising, and I feel like with, like, the, I was okay with Detective Pikachu and, like, the realistic-ass-looking Pikachu, I know some people weren't. Especially when it came to Mr. Mime. But Mr. Mime has always been fucking creepy and don't you act like he hasn't been. But I'm talking about like, Pikachu himself looks adorable. I would cuddle. But, you could tell the eyes are bulging. Yes, and that's what's weird. It just, uh, it concerns me greatly. And I'm not even like, uh... Like, it's one of those things that it's like, when you've got, like, the silhouette of a creature, like, if you showed us the silhouette of Detective, Detective Pikachu, right? Like, no one would be like, oh, no. Oh, no. You know? But everyone, literally, like, the internet has become so toxic and polarized as of the last couple of years, but it is, like, universal across the aisles. It doesn't matter what your political opinion is is it it's everyone hates the new sonic look everyone thinks it's bad we can unite under this one banner for this short amount of time and agree that's fucking creepy Mowgli licking these nuts that sucks what that's it that's it that's what they that's what they were trying to get me to do that's dumb that's not even a good one. I made that joke on, uh, well, let me progress the plot a little bit and I'll, I'll tell you guys a story. Um, that almost got me in a bunch of trouble. Uh, I'll come back to it in a minute. But it's something that actually could end the war. Hmm. Hmm. I'm sorry, but that's just not possible. Well, here's hoping. I think I'm starting to get on in time. How about we call it for the eve? Yeah. I think I've had enough of this. But anyway, um... So, I made that joke on the other day on Twitter that was like, Oh, 
you know, I, the, the joke being something along the lines of, like, I keep asking people what Ligma is and they keep being super rude about it. The joke being that I know what Ligma is. I know that joke, right? And then, you know, hey, Bobaneer, thank you for 29 months of support. That's very kind of you. I'm doing all right. Um, so anyway, um, Lego Mowgli Dick. What? 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 I mean, I guess Lego could be part of it. That makes sense. Anyway, um, so Tilda likes to read my tweets, and then sometimes she'll bring it up to me, like, if I say something stupid. And she's like, honey, what's what's Ligma? What, what is this joke? I don't get it. And I had to, like, make a decision. Like, there was a moment there where I actually had to make a decision. Like, do I want to sleep on the couch tonight? And I'm like, well... It's a joke. It's a joke that people do. And, um... When someone asks, what is... What is Ligma? Um... You say, Ligma balls. It's sort of an up dog situation. She's like, what's up, dog? And I'm like, not much. What's up with you? And she just got confused. I want to sleep on the bed. I want to sleep in the bed. All right, don't call me a coward. We're surrounded all by all sides by awful dark spirits. Read my last message. Uh Nah, she just missed out on that meme, I think. Let go Mowgli dick. Let go of my ugly dick. What the fuck? Apparently questionable travelers. She's getting in and out of this town is a nightmare. So we're just waiting for Charges army to follow. Let's see if we can get out of this town. Hi. Guess you'll be on your way then, hey? Sorry if uh, stuff got a little heavy last night. It's okay. I died, I think. I want to be here... I want here to be as loving as it can be. With enough bad stuff going on outside. <sighs> tell the king we said hey, and if you find anyone who can come out here, tell him we're okay, too. Worried for my granddaughter and her Qu Quinn. Quinn? I'm gonna go with Quinn. Why do you have a Q without a U? That's not how letters work. Literally, name two words that have Q and then some letter that isn't U directly afterwards. Q is a less useless fucking letter. I've said it before. Kin? Q is pronounced like K. Fuck you, game! Intelligence quotient. How much longer are we going to be trapped here? This ain't no place for a girl to grow up. Well, you see, sir. You're right. Bye! Do I have to, do I have to fucking rearrange the alphabet? I will turn this whole fucking alphabet around again. I'm so done with this place. Let's get out of here. I'm flying. Yeah, I guess this is like the, uh, the China-themed letter, or area. I'm sorry, I'm still tripped up on the Q pronounces a K- Hello? 
Are you a monster? I guess so. Oh, wow. You. Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Little B! Who's this? Oh, you know. Just an old buddy. She's in cahoots with the hero. Cahoots, huh? Little B, I'm in cahoots with everyone. You're all my special little buds. I'll oh, pick favorites. Except for you did. You literally did. You literally did. I don't like her. What happened here? Big fight. Between Audrey and some of the monsters, I mean. And Audrey and... Me and Audrey are still cool. Isn't it Audrey and I? You bit, You created the world. You could make the grammar so that way me and Audrey was correct. And you didn't. And then you followed it up by being wrong. Fuck you. It was crazy. The monsters were all like, blah, 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 blah. And Audrey was like, swing, sap, pow. She's just so cool. She saved the city big time this time. They're celebrating with her right now. Oh, great. So she's here. Now you all get to hang out more. You know, I have no idea what Bitch Lasagna 1.2 is. I, I have not watched a great deal of PewDiePie videos, so I don't I don't know too much about him. I did get um some accidental copyright claims this morning. It was uh from um Jack Septicai of all people. It was just like the cutscenes for two games, and he was super fast. Like I, I sent in a thing, I'm like, hey, I think you made a mistake. And then like within like Five minutes it was released and turned around and it was all good like normally you can wait about a month and they'll just let it run out but props you know shout out to Jack Jacksepticeye for realizing that the automated system made a mistake and letting it go never thought I'd say shout out to Jack Jacksepticeye but there you go uh, I don't know if he's personally responsible for that. I would imagine it's someone on his team because he's big enough to have a team. Your comments about PewDiePie did make me think of Jacksepticeye. I'm not going to lie. I don't think I want to see her. She sucks. She's really not that bad once you get to know her at least. But okay, I'm out. I'm just here zoning out here. Didn't expect to see you, but, uh, hey, good luck on the whole Earth Song thing. Peace. I mean, there are these cranes everywhere. She didn't notice us. She definitely did. She's just being too cool to notice. Joke's on her. I'm gonna drink some, uh, so that means that I'm gonna do little dances. Joke's on her. Well, she's getting bitty, busy fawned on, we can go straight to the king. Deliver your silly message and get ahead on the real quest. End of the world, overseer song, remember? Sounds like a plan. Do I have any more thieves in planned? Uh, sure. I mean, like, whatever you guys feel like, I'll do. I mean, like, Nintendo games are on the fucking board again. And so that means that buying a Switch is not an awful idea. Though, the main reason I was going to buy a Switch, I found out today that I didn't need to. Because uh, the main reason I was going to buy one was to uh, get a uh, get Katamari Damacy reroll. But apparently, that's on Steam now. So, I don't need it. Uh, and with monsters attacking us now, I guess it's not safe either.
I, I, I don't have a lot of interest in Smash, but I think I need to stop being like that and just play games that, like, people want to see. So maybe stuff like, uh, I don't know. I got some, I got a 64. I got an SNES. If you got a preference, I can go and buy games for them. Like, there's, a, I mean, my work gets cheap ass, like, games all the time. So if you guys like have any preference for old SNES 64 games, can you play Jerk It Out by Caesar's Palace with the notes in this game? You know, I don't know the 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 notes. Earthbound series? Jesus Christ. Maybe something a little bit shorter. Play whatever you want. I try and find some weird shit every now and then. A Pokemon Nuzlocke. Oh shit, I could actually do that. Is there a way to do that where it's not as grindy and would be, like, watchable? Do art? Uh, I do, uh, I mean, like, obviously I'm just gonna take the suggestions that you guys say that I actually feel like play. 24 hour Pong stream. Fuck that. No one will enjoy that, so I'm doing it. No. You can make up whatever rules you want for a Nuzlocke run. That's true. I'd probably have to... I don't think you can do a Nuzlocke Let's Go Pokemon. I might have to do... I mean, fuck, where do you even get ROMs anymore? Not that I would illegally download a game, but seriously, where would I even get one? So, like... Wait, where the fuck is everyone? Maybe make a pool of five games that you want. I mean, the main thing is, like, I think there's a bunch of games that I've missed out on because I'm like, I don't know. The big illegal bad site. Yes, the big illegal bad site. They're out celebrating with the hero. Yeah, it's true, but I need them to not. Maybe I can just keep going out. Oh, maybe. Palace up the hill. I thought that place down the hill over there was the thing, but... The grind is kind of the meat of a Pokemon game. I think Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee kind of points it out clearly. Yeah. You take that out and people say it's casual and easy. But it's just like, is that the part of the game you enjoyed? Oh, hey. Oh, hey now, Wanderer. You again. What are you doing here? Me? I'm catching some sun. Sun's good for you, Wanderer. It's so warm. It just feels right, you know? Found a great place to catch the sun. High up in the spot in the desert, not far from here. If you find it, well... I better not say. It's up for you to discover. Okay. Is this the desert? Where are we going? I might have to. I might have to do a Nuzlocke run. Okay. If I was going to do a Nuzlocke, what, uh, what, what is the best one to do it on? Because, like, I'm sure there's, like, just send me, like, recommendations or, like, whatever, and I will I will figure out what I need to. Emerald's a good one. A lot of people saying Emerald. It's fairly PC emulator. Okay, but, yeah, but which one? Save states seem like a good choice. I'm going to probably fuck it up. Emerald is the OG Nuzlocke. Emerald seems like the choice. Okay, I'm going to write that down. If you have any other recommendations as far as Nintendo stuff, I think I think there's a lot of stuff I missed because of um, just swearing off Nintendo since they were like, no streaming. I'm like, okay, I'm not getting into any legal trouble. I'm not a big enough YouTuber to deal with that. Emerald. Pokemon. Nuzlocke. Probably like a shitty one. Check out Prism. Prism as well. Okay. Fuck Whitney. Fuck Miltake. Doesn't it give you exactly what you need? Like the dungeon before? Like the one before? Yeah, the Machop, right? That That's how you beat it. You just use the Machop you're given. And then you can one-shot it. Right? 
Isn't that the point? Of my chop? Hello! Uh, hello. We're here to meet the king or whatever. Can you go get him or something? Absolutely not. In case you hadn't noticed, we are at war. But it's my sole duty to protect the king from harm. We're not allowing anyone in or out at this time. Diamond to pearl nuzlocks aren't that hard. But if that Machop dies, just don't let it die. Uh... Pearl. Diamond. And especially not witches. What? That's ridiculous. Nobody? What about you? Don't you go in and out? Obviously, we make some exceptions. You've invited the hero for a special visit. But unless of you are of her caliber, no way, sister. Her. Of course it's her. However, you can feel free to enjoy the exquisite castle garden. Oh, sure, I'm just gonna ravish your stupid garden. Can't get enough. Maybe eat all your stupid trees and flowers. Miriam, they're so damn exquisite. Uh, yeah, but sun and moon sock. Like, I, I really feel bored playing moon. Like, I've got moon. And I like the characters. Like, Mimikyu is probably my favorite Pokemon now. But, um... In all the other Pokemon games, I feel like I'm a child that was just, like, unsupervised and allowed to get in, like, fist fight with gangsters and mobsters. In Sun and Moon, it's like, Hey, welcome to Tourist Town. Would you like to see Thing? Yes. Alright, now moving on to the next attraction. It's like going to the zoo or, like, the museum where you have a tour guide that's pointing out things. It's like, oh, oh, it's just dull. And I know I'm like, I, I think it's just because I'm old now. But I loved that sense of adventure when I was a kid. Is it just me or is that just the way it is? Like, I just want to, yeah, I just want to walk down a hallway without someone throwing plot at me. Because that was the nice thing about red and blue. It's like the plow is pretty razor thin. But that was okay. And then I played, uh, I think it was, what's the one with Kyogre and, uh, the, the other one? I bootlegged it onto my phone. And that was good. I beat that. Because there was a plot, but I wasn't really paying attention and it worked right. Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald. We should go, Miriam. Yeah, sure. This is a Pokemon stream now. It's not even Wander Song anymore. We're just going to talk about Pokemon and Pokemon things. Gah! Can't believe this. What do we do now? Um, well, we could forget about the, your ghost message. No! Hey, Rev, you should play Skyrim. I played Skyrim. You can go watch my entire playthrough where I stopped halfway through because fuck it. We could end the war, Miriam. We can't quit yet. Well, we can talk to your good buddy, the hero. No. No. Those are our choices. I think we should focus on finding the Overseer song, but you do you. Well, maybe they're all related. You should play Seven Tech Ages, maybe with Mike. Oof. 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 If it weren't for Mike, I would have fucking, like, rage quit that long before now. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Yeah, I've been streaming that with Mike, and that is, without the, uh, without, what is this? Uh, 
Hello. Are you interested in any potions? I made them all myself. The science behind it is very interesting. I source all of my ingredients from nature, and I happily... And I apply the knowledge from chemistry to make new concoctions. My potions are high quality. They produce consistent results. You should buy some. That sounds fun. I don't have any money, though. Oh. I was trying to harmonize my burp with the note, and it just didn't work. Drugs! Maybe you should just play, like, vanilla Minecraft with Mike. You know, I've been thinking about that. It was a bit forced. So I was trying to change the pitch. And it's hard to do that. Welcome to my humble caravan. Well, I'm going to pause the game because we just ran into a furry. And I think that's where we stop games for a minute. Um, today's current game is Shadow Warrior 2. They're doing... So... I don't care about that. I'll be honest with you. Uh, but, but Kronog's thing for the last couple of days has been like the best selling games of the year. So the good games are going to be consistently on Kronog for the next little bit here. Uh, so if you're interested in getting games on the cheap, I mean, it's a $40 game for eight bucks. If it looks interesting, great. But like more importantly, uh, wait for a good one to drop by and get it then check check more often until the end of the year will it have red dead no it's gonna have the stuff that was on the uh chronog website this year i think that's their thing anyway i'm gonna go uh i'm gonna go piss at light and speed the coin shop is uh doing two times uh points right now and I, I haven't looked into the coin shop all that much just because like I can game it super easy by like being like you know in contact with them but insurgency's on there 4,000 coins I don't know how many you get for clicking the little spinny thing some I don't know some anyway uh that's a good one anyway I'm gonna go pee and then I'll be right back um how about you guys watch this ad, BRB? All right, am I back? I think I'm almost back. How are you guys doing? I just want to say I saw the go- Oh, you saw a gopter shirt in the wild? Did you punch that fool? I mean, like, did you say hello to them? That's awesome. That makes my day. I wonder if those are ever going to end up in, like, a, uh... 
like Goodwill or something and someone's gonna pick it up ironically and then they're gonna wear it not knowing what the fuck it's from. Like, can you imagine if one of those hipster bands that like says half the words but doesn't sing them like ends up getting, I don't know, that as like the shirt they wear on the fucking cover of some album. Like, um, the shoelaces she left me. That's a good name for a hipster hipster song, album, or band. What the fuck does that mean? Who knows? But it sounds important. No one wants to do business with a panda. Rrr, rrr, rrr. Yep, I don't. Goodbye. I'm betting. I'm betting I need to go out into the desert. Desert? You saw a Gopter shirt in a Goodwill? That's pretty awesome. I'm okay with infecting the world with my weird shirts. I should probably clean up my shop and just have it like be one or two. I keep saying I'm gonna do that. It's an old meme from a uh, Baby Hazel stream I did. Do I get something for getting all these? What do you want to bet I get something for getting all of them? Is this the desert here? No, I want to go to the desert. Get the fuck out of here with this not desert garbage. Need to learn how to dance. That's pretty cool, Shara. I guess there are more people who bought those shirts than I realize. Yeah, unfortunately, the shirt shirt is more expensive because it says something on both sides it's got like my little logo on the back and it says shirt on the front right so that kind of makes it more expensive because it's technically two graphics originally it was text and a graphic which made it the same cost as everything uh I think that gate up top is the red sun. Yeah, this symbol. I think it's like one of those. Uh... So anyway, because it's got two logos on it, it counts as having two graphics and that's an issue. Originally it was text, but people could edit the text and so they just started making it so that way the front said daddy and the back just had a picture of my little symbol and that wasn't okay with me. So that's why it's more expensive because people have a daddy kink. That's the reason you have to pay more for the shirt shirt. <laughs> Rejects, thank you for seven months of support. Are a million billion suns like ours, but ours is special to us because it gave us life. And it gives more every day. Just gives and gives and gives. We're so lucky to have it. We humans aren't like the sun. Sometimes you give and sometimes they take two. The sun will eventually take us all in a burning inferno. Thousands of years in the future. But it's it's chill. Anyway, what's up, man? I mean, like, the garden is really nice. I'm very stuck. I'm not going to lie. I don't know what the fuck to do. Rejax, thank you for seven months of support. Paper song.
How do I how do I go somewhere from here? Like what am I trying to achieve? Wonder how many daddy rev shirts actually exist. They're very rare. Unless if they're bootleg. And honestly, bootleg rev stuff is the way to get rev stuff. Like as much as like, yeah, it makes me money or whatever, like bootleg rev shit just it's more on brand than anything I could sell. I can't sell the most on brand thing of mine. Does that make sense? Look for the hero? Yeah, I guess we gotta go kick her ass. Or we could talk to people, I guess. Do you see the hero? She was here earlier because she's so cool. I think she went to the lodge. Yep, there we go. I want to meet her so bad. Alright, well, guess we're going to the lodge and we're gonna sing at her real loud. And it's gonna piss her off and then we're gonna kick her ass and then we're gonna leave. What's up, everybody? Go fuck yourself. Well, well, well. If it isn't my favorite bard and bitch. I didn't know you two were in town. That's crap. We walked right by you earlier. Did you? Well, what's shaking? We want to meet the king. Of rule? Yeah, I guess he's laying pretty low these days. Got to be pretty important to meet him. Yeah, we get it. Why do you get to meet the king? All this attitude. It doesn't really matter, does it, Bryn, uh, Witch? DIY bootlegs is just so much more on brown brand. I don't know the story behind this, but this seems counterproductive. Just ass kicking. Maybe. DIY bootleg is, is perfect. And just like, kind of like, th slap some random Disney character or something on there as well. Just do it without having context. You know? That's the way to do a proper red sh rev shirt. Without my permission. And and with other characters that I don't have the rights to. Sheesh, all this attitude. For your information, I saved the city from a giant monster attack. And I need to learn the Overseer song from the king. Important saving the world business, you know. The king knows the overseer song? We need that too. You do? Oh, yeah. I guess that does make sense. How else are you going to keep the keep breaking into the spirit world? Tell you what. I'll help you out. Sure. I'll bring you along to my meeting later. I could use a couple of flunkies. Flunkies? I mean, I don't have to bring you. No, 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 we'll do it. Cool. But hey, listen. Since I'm doing you both such a huge favor, I could use one from you too. Like what? Nothing hard. Just need to get a potion of power from the local shop. Can you pick one up for me? It would really be a huge help. You know, if you wanted to tag along later. Can we get like a shit potion of shitting? A laxative? Originally, I just meant a bad potion, but then I was like, wait a minute. I mean, the hero is kind of a bitch. That's... She's got confidence, but when you actually, like, think about it, like... The hero is a bitch. That's the point. Of, of the game. I guess. Like, we're the real heroes of our own journey. Yeah, everyone's the main character of their own story. I'm going to go out into the waste real quick. <laughs> what the fuck is this? This is, uh, this is Wonder Song. It's a cute little game about saving the world. How do I fuck around in the desert? D 
Do you think I gotta get, like, all of the little, like, butterfly friends? Do you think this is relevant at all? It's a... Shut up. Nothing's girly. I don't give a fuck. I play games I want to play. That's what people were just saying they like me for. And if that means... Hey. Don't get us lost in the wrong kingdom. Rules back the other way. Right. Can you move off the path? Not really. It's... I'm essentially walking on the ground. I know it seems like I'm on a path, but when I press that, that's me jumping. God damn it. So that's there's no point in the butterflies. The butterflies don't matter. Babby games. No, that's fine. Honestly, I like my shooting games. Every now and then you'll see me play a Babby game and you're like, "The fuck?" Uh, hello. It's you again. We're here for the potion of power. Wow. You didn't strike me as such high rollers. Will cost quite a few far quads. Far what's? Um, far quads? Is in currency, money? Oh. We don't have any of that. What about my sexy dance? Oh. Well, in that case, you can't have it. Oh. Well, can we do something for you to give it to us? Maybe exposure? I could go outside and tell everyone about your shop and then you just give me shit for free? Maybe for some of my other potions, but the potion of power is very luxurious. You wouldn't need a treasure chest of Farquaad to afford it. Forget about it. Me and my grandma used to make potions. It's not that hard. Screw you and your hoity-toity store. Let's do it ourselves. We're way cheaper. Oh, I hate it when people go into a fucking craft store and say that. I mean, it's true in this case, but every other time, no. Is there, isn't there something else I can do for you? You like the way my hips swing? You can get involved, baby. All right, we got this. Bootlegging shit. Bard, screw that guy, and screw the hero. She knows we can't afford the fancy potions. She's trying to embarrass us. Oh, but I wasn't kidding. We can make it ourselves. It took me a minute to remember, but I definitely know all the ingredients for that one. Probably. These are all the. Those are all the ingredients we need. Just flowers and plants. See, not that hard. Probably assumed that we'd never be able to get it, and that's why she agreed to help us at all. We could beat her at her own game. Then we'll have to admit that she was lying. And since her pride is on the line, she'll probably actually just take us to the king and said, I'm not sure I'm following. Uh, I believe it's an indie dev. I don't remember the name of the developer. Uh, let me double check that. Uh, dev's name ba -ba 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 is Greg Lobanov. I think it's just one dude. Self-published. Uh, solid game. You can get the soundtrack as well. The game itself is 20 bucks. The soundtrack is, uh, well, it's in three separate volumes. You got the, uh, $7 one, uh, volume one, and then $7 for two. And then there's, uh, $5 for the remix album. And then they did a couple other games, uh, Coin Crypt and Perfection. I, I wonder, I don't think it's all made by one dude. See, yeah. There you go. These people made it. These people did. Those people. 
Doesn't matter. Let's just get those ingredients. I'm actually excited to show her up like this. <laughs> it's gonna be poison. Oh, she's smiling for once. What are the chances? Oh. Is that the right kind of leaf? Uh. It's kind of a vindictive smile, but sure. The butterflies in Zantan are nice. If you sing, they follow you around. But they get bored fast if you stop. You can bring If you can bring five to the street, I think something special would happen. And you have to bring them all from the same zone. It could be the wrong leaf, but if it makes a shitty version of it, then that's fine. I got four. I think I got four of them. Yeah, I got four of them. Just a dial tone going off in the background as your friend jumps around like a fucking asshole. That's what it's like. That's what it's like to be on an adventure! Ingredient get! I wonder if it actually matters. I bet it does. Get. I know I've seen that flower about because it was like conspicuous and I wanted to pick it up but I couldn't. But I don't remember where it was. Oh fuck, he's got a mushroom. That man is a fox furry. No, he's not. He's a raccoon furry. You can can you also make him say like really naughty words like pussy if you get it just right? I noticed this stream. Thank you for the 25 months of support. If Rev were a scaly, he would probably be a ball python. Chill, quiet, fun to hang out with. Well, you're banned. Uh, thank you for 20 my well 25 months of support. I hate that. Hi, what about your yellow mushroom? I need it for a potion. Can I have it? I wish I could just give it away, but I need money badly. I had to sell my horse and now I'm trapped in the city. Oh, I'm so sorry. But maybe there's, there's something I could do in exchange for it. Gee, well, business has been very slow. If there was a way you could help me with promotion. For example, by performing in front of my caravan? I can do that. You'll have to write a theme song for my shop. I have some guidelines for success with this. It may be a panda, but... Uh, oh, you're like a red panda. Okay. But after all, I understand humans very well. You're not a panda. You're not a... P yep. Yep. You can... You could be a furry, but you're... But you're not, you, you're not, no, no, you can't be a, but you're not a fucking animal. Stop it. I like patterns and repetition. Whatever song you write, it's going to have to sing over and over without changing anything. So make it interesting, but not too interesting. Is this the song you want? Yeah, it sounds like a siren going off. You guys, you guys like it? You guys like it? 
It's awful. It's like when a siren's going off, like you're trying to get like an ambulance through and it's like, it's not like an actual ambulance, it's like a 1920s ambulance. I think it's great. Now, we just need to sing it over and over again and the humans will come flocking. No, that's not- no, this isn't good. Go away, ma'am. No one wants to hear this sound. It's awful. Look at all the customers who came. All thanks to your saying. They all, they're all coming because they just want to rubberneck and see the fucking song. Like, they want to see who died. I got you. No problem giving you this. Great. I did it. Yay. I'm going to be rich now. You're not. You're going to be broke. Good luck with that shit. Alright, now where the fuck did we see the uh, shine gets? That's what it's from. This game has little nods to, like, a lot of Nintendo shit. Fuck, I'm excited to start a Nuzlocke now. I'm gonna have to look up how to do it. I know it's like, if your Pokemon gets knocked out, you have to release them. That would make me really depressed. I'm still depressed that my Alakazam, like, level 100 Alakazam from gold is gone forever because the battery died in it. You know? That's a bad feel. A lot of people put them in a box and just never let them out. That might be the way to do it, because otherwise I'm just depressing. It. It's the first Pokemon on a route as well, and you just kind of kind of roll with stuff, so you can't really get what you want. Like, getting an Alkazam would be almost impossible, because of how much of a bitch it is to catch a fucking Abra. A box of dead Pokemon. Here are they, they're dead. Hey, I found one of the ingredients. It's this in this rich person's backyard. I was just thinking about just taking it. What? No way! What would your grandma do? Yeah, yeah this is neutral, good as fuck. Sheesh, okay, sheesh. Let's ask for it. Just a flower, no big deal. Go right ahead. Hey. Hello? There's a blue flower in your backyard. Me and my friend need it for a potion. Can we use it? Hmm. No. Play a randomized Nuzlocke? Is that a thing? I'm sure she'll come right back out. Just stand here for a minute and... Hey. I said no. I know. But we need it to save the world. It's a long story. What if I convince you? Please help us. Insane kids. If it means that much to you, you can have it. If you do some yard work for me. We can do that. Right, Miriam? Right. Lead the way, miss. Yay! All these leaves. Move them out of my yard. Out that way. Oh, God. Or out that way.
I just brought one back in. Hey! Have you ever stopped to notice that the hero goes around fighting monsters with a cool sword, and we get stuck doing yard work? If she were here, she would just take the dumb flower. Why aren't we? Because she's fucking evil! In case you forgot, the world's about to end. And it doesn't matter if this old lady has leaves in her yard. But I mean, whatever. You do you. No. I can- I can be a good- I can be a good boy. Why aren't they going over the wall? Go over the wall. Go over the wall. Go over the wall. Go over the wall. Go over the wall with you. Over the wall with you. That's the way to do it. Right there was pretty good. There it is. And we just go from one side to the other, sweeping up the last remaining leaves. Is that good enough? You've done such a lovely job with my yard. I baked these cookies for you. Wow! See, Miriam? We did the right thing, and we got cookies. Wow, cool. What we need is the flour. Of course, I'm happy to give that as well. Yay! Could have just been so much easier. Yeah, but that's not the fucking game, is it? I got a dedicated dance button. This is not the dark, edgy game you want it to be, Miriam. Get the stick out of your ass and let's let's go and... I mean, we got cookies, okay? We got cookies. It's probably fine. Ingredient get! Well, up to you get the rest of them. Good luck. Away by the lodge where the hero's at. Yay! Now I just gotta figure out what the frog is. I don't remember seeing it. You can use these guys to get things. I mean, the frog leads me to believe this is probably going to be poison, which would be a good idea, honestly. Just get some nightshade and just straight up murder her. I mean, I'm not opposed to the idea. The bard would be. Well, fucker. Could be a frog. Could be the frog in the potion shop. The what and the where? Really? You think there's anything in the other castle? Like, we didn't even bother to check. We just beelined straight from the end, straight in the other direction. There could definitely be something there. Maybe there is something there. I mean, it's probably the frog in the, the thing, but there might be dances out here. There might be dances we could be doing. Lime says hi. Hello, raid that's happening right about now. There it is. Hi, guys. We're playing Wander Song. It's cute. You'll enjoy it. Moobot is set to kill. 
So be careful of that. Thank you for the, the, the raid there, Limes. It's very kind of you. <laughs> Chatter is just getting murdered. Well, staff abuse. This is the this is the problem with Twitch staff. They come in and they abuse their privileges. Start posting emotes all over the goddamn place. This is the Sky Temple. Yep. The next nexus point. People built the whole temple around it. But the place, the only place that matters really is, uh, what's the place that matters? Not really the temple. What's special about the palace? Never really figured that out either. The nexus point seems to be near natural formations. But they're just places where a lot of spirit stuff, spirit stuff is kind of everywhere and invisible. Because our worlds and the spirit worlds are interlinked. Limes the staff? Yeah. It's literally the little logo next to her name. Basically, my grandma could explain it better. Anyway, it's useless for now. Overseer song, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So we're not missing anything. Anyway, jump off a cliff, break her kneecaps on the way down, and we're here we go. So yeah, we there's nothing there. Sook. I don't think there's any point to those guys. I want there to be a point to them, but there's not. Also, I noticed it'll still slow me down if I press the dance button, even though I'm on a broom and can't dance. Would it be a ward and a swinch? Swinch seems like a curse word that I'm not aware of. Like, it's a slur for a very specific organization of people, and I don't know who they are. Don't you think? It sounds like... For, like, it's a racist term for some race that isn't a thing. Swinch. I apologize for saying ra There's no, there's no frog here. Whoever the soggy little bitch is that said that there was a frog here is wrong. There's no, there's no, there's no frog. The japes are real. Hey, do you have any frogs? I would like frog. I was down by the harbor and a bunch of swinches came by. Jesus Christ. Hey, do you know where any frogs are? Hey. I'm sitting here. You want something? Yeah. Every so uppity about the hero gal, not me. Don't give a crap. As soon as somebody's popular, I kind of get suspicious, you know? Nobody's that good. She's kind of a phony. She has to be. You know what? You're actually fucking right for once. The hero is actually a total bitch. So if you haven't seen this game before, you can sing at any time, and that's generally how you solve problems in this game and how you respond. It'll give you, like, no or yes prompts like that and then you can press the dedicated dance button I've unlocked all of these dances it's important as that it does nothing but it's it's important though you need to understand Show them the smug dance? I mean, I can't really, because I have to be smug first to be able to dance. This? It's a good game. It's, it's cute. It has a bit of a downer moment about halfway in, but it turns out okay, because dude's a fucking champ and pulls out. Brings it home. 
I bet you it's... I mean, where the fuck is this frog? Has anyone seen this frog? How do I even know that man? I don't know that man, but I'm just assuming that most of the time he calls out people for... Like, just because something pop is popular doesn't mean that it's, like, a bad thing. He just happens to be right about this one specific thing. Some things are popular and good. Like, uh... Vine sauce. Toast, toast is good. Toast, just toast, toast. It's true. They're good. Breathing is good. That's pretty popular. Everyone's into that. And if you're not into that, get sick. Like, have a cold and tell me that you're not into the idea of being able to breathe again. You also walk past the frog. Where is the frog? Give me the. F give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give frog. Ooh, game. Oh, game did not like that. There's a very specific frame that. Oh. You okay there, game? Oh. Oh. Let's go ahead and, uh. Let's go ahead. Ooh. Let's just go ahead and uh, quit out of the game real quick. Something's going on. And it crashed. Task manager up this bitch. Let me see what's going on. What's going on? Uh, OBS is using uh, five gigs 500k is like five megabytes right 500 megabytes and 21 percent okay that's about right firefox is using about slightly more processing than than wonder song chrome which i didn't even realize was open but i guess it is i need to post uh am i training for tasks i i did start trying to practice um what is it strider just kind of on a whim I got like this weird thing. I could play through some of those. It's got like Strider and uh, Mega Man 2 and 3. I beat 2 off screen. It was good. Why do these people have spirit animals? I don't know. It didn't explain shit. Who has the frog? But uh, doing the, the thing in Strider is super easy. It's just like you, uh, you set yourself up near the wall and then you aggressively moonwalk into it. Or it's the running man, where you do the thing where you, like, walk in place. It's not quite moonwalking. Slightly different dance move. But you do that until you clip into the wall and then you're- Hey, give me your frog! Hey, look at this cool frog I found. Wow. Me and my friend need a frog like that. Can I have it? Okay. Yay! It's dead. Oh, okay. Thanks. I think she wanted round leaves and not square leaves and living ones and not dead ones and mushrooms that aren't glowing rather than glowing ones. But you know what? Close the fuck enough. Right? Good enough for horseshoes and hand grenades. Good enough for me. No one plays horseshoes, so that just doesn't really make sense anymore, but... Close enough for, um... Tumblr modification? Or, like, Tumblr mods? And... Grenades? Does that make sense? That's a sentence. Those are words you can put in a thing. The frog probably has a leech in it. Alright. Who plays hand grenades? I mean, it's not really a game as much as it is a weapon of destruction. I can understand how you'd be confused. There are some games that border that that line. Like, um, I want to say Monopoly? Mario Party? Um, Mar Go Kart. Mario Kart.
Where the fuck is the hotel again? I've totally forgotten. God, I'm dumb. There it is. I found it. Hey, I found it. You got all the ingredients? Heck yeah. Great. Let's see him. Literally none of these are right. Huh? I mean, they're close. But they're all the wrong species or off color. Oh. Also, the frog was supposed to be alive. Oh. I can work with this, though. If you need instruction on how to get to the hotels... There's a pot inside the lodge we can use. Hopefully the hero doesn't notice us. It's close enough, right? Close enough? Sexy dance for the potions. Is it gonna work? Probably not. But if it doesn't have it work, it just has to look like it will. Potion making runs in my blood. It'll be fine. Your parents make potions too? I don't know. Never met them. Oh. They left me with grandma before I can remember. When I was a kid, she'd tell me that they were coming back for me someday. But eventually she stopped saying that. She basically abandoned me. Oh. This is why this game is good, because dedicated dance button is just like, ah, oh. yeah? I'm sorry. That sounds really sad. Only when I think about it. Grandma Safi is all the family I ever needed. She may ever forget I was missing anything. Is singing helping? If I just go... Did that help? Did that bring your parents back? Did you ever have the feeling of childhood again because of that note? A childhood where you had parents and and not being abandoned because they knew you were a bitch even as a baby. Uh, I was always did have a feeling that maybe if I worked hard enough and made myself into something, something heroic and famous, that they'd notice and realize what a mistake they made leaving me and come back. But that's a ridiculous idea. I don't even care if I see them now. Actually, I'm pretty sure I never want to. I can't do anything heroic anyway. Alright. We're gonna save the world, Miriam! Trying to. Would you look at that? The potion's all done. Potion get! Looks weird. Yeah. Might actually be deadly. Let's see if the hero likes it. Yay! Poisons! What's up? Bitch. There you are. That took forever. Did you fall asleep or something? You almost made me late. I don't have time to hear about your hilarious excuses. Point is, you couldn't get it, right? Mm, no, actually, we have it right here. Really? Show her the goods, bard. Like this? Like, like this? Like this. Is this good? Like this. This is the goods. Doing a little jig. Drop it down low, but it can't during the cutscene. Oh, you mean the potion. Huh. Well, great job. This is a huge favor. No problem. So now you'll take us to the king, right? Yes. But we have to go right now. Those are some goods. Not those goods. What about these goods? All right, flunkies. Excited? Just keep behind me. Hey, watch it. Stay behind me, all right?
What are you doing? It's the ghost message. It knows that we're close to the king. I think it's trying to get out of me. Oh, that's not creepy. You two okay back there? No, no, yep, yep, no problem. Ha ha ha. Uh, okay. Try to keep up. I can, can I? I don't know if I can do that. I don't know if I can do that little jig. I can't dance. Dying again. Sorry. Hold on. God. Hey, keep it together. We're almost here. There. Okay. Booty. I was trying to do a quick walk, but it didn't work, and then I realized that that was funny, so uh, I just went with it. Hey. Neat line seal, I guess, or is it just a straight up line? Now presenting His Royal Majesty, the King of Rule himself. Thank you, thank you. Okay, great. Very nice meeting you all. Wow. Just very great. Obviously, we have a lot going on right now. The big invasion in three days, all that. So, sorry if I seem a little bit terse. What? An invasion? Majesty, that was supposed to be a secret. Oh. Oof. This is why I can't talk to outsiders anymore. Too many secrets to keep track of. Secrets for days. Hey, uh, is your buddy okay? King. Your war is tearing us apart, Lisa! Demonic possession is a good way of meeting up with the king. Did that work or did we fuck that up? <laughs> Wake up immediately, start with that. Oh! What happened here? Oh, there you are. You're saying your stupid message to the king. Oh, right, the message. Ghost is actually a princess from Chen Desh. Huh. And she wanted the war to end. Did it work? The message? No. It completely did not work. The king was really insulted by it. He threw you in jail. And then he eventually taught the hero the song. I had to spy on them to learn it. And I had to bust you out of jail. It was pretty cool, Heroic, and... Jeez. You really passed out for all that, yeah? Guess so! I'm sorry I caused so many problems. It's a good thing you were here there to help me out. Again. That's fine. I'm getting used to saving your butt. Oh, wait! The king said that we were they were invading in three days. Is that still gonna happen? What are you gonna do, Miriam? Two days now. And I don't know. It's not our problem. For now, we're going to the Sky Temple. The nexus point, right next to the border. 
We're just gonna have to... We just need to go meet the Overseer. That's the priority. In fact, we're going to get there now. Well, I fucking tried. Feeling better? Yes. Yeah, kind of just wobbly. Like this, kind of wobble. Great. Well, it's long time. I guess I'll play it on my piccolo. Since I'm the one who knows it this time. Great! This feels weird. Don't, um... Don't listen too closely, okay? I'm not so fancy pants musician, okay? It's pretty good, actually. Oh, that was awkward. I don't think it worked. Probably because my sucky playing. You try it. Thought you played it very nicely. Wait, 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 hold up. What do you want? It's some kind of mess up. That song's not gonna work. Why can't I do anything right? No, 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 I mean, that's not the whole song. The King of Rule ain't knew part of it. The other part was in Chandesh. You gotta talk to the queen there. Oh, she's super dead. Does the hero know that? We just figured it out. Something weird is going on in the spirit world here. She didn't want me to tell you, but I do what I want. I'm still rooting for you, little B. And you too, Miriam. You two are a super cute team. Thanks. Okay, I'm a skedaddle. Audrey probably needs me. Love you too. Peace. I hate her. Same. So are we going to Chandesh? I guess so. I like the color palette here. It's really nice. Someone was telling me uh, yesterday, if you go into Borderlands, I think it was two or one. And you change one line of code from Jeff to like John, it completely like gets rid of the cell shading. This is the first I had heard of it. It's probably just like a thing everyone knows. But I was like, oh, that's interesting. I think he thought I was mocking him. We definitely don't want to go back to rule since I busted you out of jail. We're basically fugitives now. Oh. Yeah. I told you. Rules. They gotta be broken. Where the fuck is Shandesh? I thought it was over here. But apparently it's this way. And I think that's probably where we're gonna leave it today. Because I just saved right now. These colors are nice. I like them too. They're good colors. <laughs> that was weak. Oh, Ima just started hosting me. Well, shit. I was just about to wrap up. I'm loving the the um, Smash Brothers streams, by the way. I'm a, another reason for me to not bother with it is because, like, I, I played Ima once. I know some of you guys, like, are just here from her. But I played her once uh, in the 64 game. And she played, like, whatever the shady player or character is on 64. And, uh... Oh, hi, Emma. Thank you for 38 months of support. Holy shit. Uh, she played the shitty character and still kicked my ass. Um... So, if you want to see someone play Smash, she actually, like, plays competitively. So, she won't get stuck on stupid parts and she'll actually be good at it. And she's good people. So go watch her play Smash. I'm going to skip Smash and force you to watch her instead. There are no shitty characters in 64. Who was it that you kicked my ass with? It wasn't Pikachu or Kirby, because those are the good ones, right? It was someone bad. Also, I like Captain Falcon, but Captain Falcon's good in that one, right? She just stopped. I know, but just in the future, 
I'm I'm going to assume I'm is going to stream more of that. But anyway, um, that that's probably gonna be it for me for today. I'm sorry, y'all. Um, everyone is viable. Well, shit. Unlike some fake gamer we know. Yes, yes. I was thinking about getting a. I, I need to get a Nuzlocke together. I think that's the next thing I stream after I get done with this is probably a Nuzlocke. Um, cause I think people in chat have convinced me into it. That and Dagnamit Ron Paul. Um, I don't remember. I don't know actually which one's the first one. I am a, you like Dagnamit Ron Paul, right? Which one's the first one? Which one do I play first and how much reading is going to be there and how much is it going to fuck with my dyslexia? I don't know. Anyway, uh, that's where I'm going to call it for today, y'all. I hope you enjoyed the stream. For those of you who just got here, check out the Wander Song streams. They're good. Dang Nabbit 1. Oh, does Dang Nang Ding Ding Dong Nabbit Ron Paul? It's all reading. It's basically a visual novel. Should be good. Shit. All right. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys uh, when I do. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Okay, bye. Where's the button to stop?